Imagine a person with cerebral palsy. It is a condition that's primarily characterized by central nervous system abnormalities, such as loss of selective motor control. In this case, person is unable to walk. Orthosis as medical devices are used to improve functions, restrict or enforce motion, or support a body segment. The focus in my thesis is on hip knee ankle foot orthosis that belongs to a group of orthosis for lower extremities and is used by patients suffering from cerebral palsy in order to help them walk and move around. Orthosis should provide stability and autonomous use. However, this is not always the case. Observing the usage of hip knee ankle foot orthosis by a patient, several issues have been noticed in the current knee mechanism, especially when changing posture from standing to sitting and opposite. Let's now try to imagine a person with this orthosis trying to sit down. The process starts with unlocking the knee mechanism, which allows rotation in the knee to happen. But we need to remember that a person doesn't have control over lower extremities. Allowing rotation results with knee bending happening too fast. Therefore, a patient loses stability at the given moment and risks potential injuries. Another problem is transition from sitting to standing posture, which requires the upper and lower leg to be fully straightened in order to lock the knee mechanism. This requires great effort by a patient and is sometimes even impossible to achieve. The stated problems were actually the guidelines for redesigning the knee mechanism. The aim of my thesis was to propose a solution that will eliminate these problems while taking into consideration additional limitations like cost, adding weight, aesthetics, and most importantly, implementing solutions shouldn't cause unexpected critical stress on the entire construction. Based on extensive research, the final proposal was to mount a gas spring on the current knee mechanism. Gas spring, due to its damping properties, would help increasing the transition time from standing to sitting, and while standing up, would act as a support system enabling this transition to happen with very little effort. For the proposed solution, cinematic and structural analysis were done to show if the stated requirements were fulfilled, and the analysis confirmed that mounting gas spring on the current knee mechanism would eliminate design problems. To put it in a nutshell, my thesis resolved the particular patient's problem. However, this proposal could be used in various applications in similar domain, improving everyday life activities for people in need. Thank you.